Lindsay and welcome back to my channel. So today is Friday and today means pantry day. It is also candle day at Bath and Body Works. So I just showed a few clips of us going to get some candles. I will be showing all the candles that I got, how much I paid for that towards the end of this video. But I did want to uh, show you guys everything that I got at a pantry that I went to today. Like I mentioned, I do get all of my, most of my pantry items for free by going to a, f a few church pantries around my neighborhood and a little house where they have a pantry near here. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show you guys what I got today at this first church pantry. So I usually go to this pantry every Friday and they always have new items. So today they gave us some hot dog breads, some of these uh, little rolls. These are so soft. They're like good for sandwich or a few different stuff. So we grabbed a few of those. These were the bread was separate. You could grab how many you wanted. And then all of this came in that brown bag. So they always give us brown bags. Like I said, everything right here will be going to another little pantry that usually items that we don't eat or that we have multiples of and we just, you know, aren't going to get through them fast enough. So I go ahead and drop them off over there. So for example, a few items that we don't eat, um, maybe like these pinto beans I might be taking over there. So I usually stock up that bag and then once that's full, I'll take it to the other pantry. But let me show you guys what we got. So we started here with these filled pieces. They're like pretzels with peanut butter. They're really good. And then we got these new Doritos 3D Spicy Ranch. I haven't tried these, but I'm excited. And then we also got this Beyond Meat Jerky. We're going to see how this tastes. Then we got this Red Lentil Rotini Pasta. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to be keeping this, but we might and we'll try it out. And then like noodles, they gave these brown rice noodles. We do have another one of these up here already from a few weeks ago. So I'm not sure if I'll be keeping that one or not. And then they also gave some spaghetti, a big, big container of crunchy peanut butter, then another Jiffy corn mix. I'll probably be giving this one away because we do have two right there. And then there's one already in the giveaway bag. So then we have diced tomatoes, and then we also have pasta sauce, and then two cans of corn, and then the pinto beans, and more spaghetti and meatballs. So I'm going to go ahead and put this up on our pantry. It's pretty stocked up now because we did go grocery shopping, so a few items like... Um, like these and maybe even these like little snacks over here that we do buy but pretty much everything else like all these chips everything right here in this corner uh not these but everything else right here and everything in there is pretty much free that i've gotten by going to church pantries other pantries around the neighborhood there is another one on december 5th which is on monday so i will be going to that one and hopefully we get a good can of can goods so all of these were also free um so yeah so like I always mention, make sure to do your research, check pantries near you and surrounding neighborhoods that still offer the food to you. And then usually churches near you, like we literally have like five churches near us and probably three out of five do have pantries. So I always recommend doing your research and seeing other places, not just churches, but there's other places that only do pantries and they give away food for people around the neighborhood. So just do your research and you are able to stock up your pantry for free, like all these good items for free. So now let's get into our Bath & Body Works haul. Alrighty guys, so like I said, it was officially candle day today at Bath & Body Works. So I'm gonna show you guys the goodies that I got. So I didn't get a lot of candles just because, whoa, my hair is looking a little crazy. But I didn't get a lot of items just because I didn't really need a lot of candles. I mainly just went for the Christmas scents. I do have another bag full of candles from last time, from last candle day. So yeah, but it was a really great deal. Last time they did have them at 13 something, the candles. And this time they were at a really low price of $9.95. So like I said, I did get four. And there was also a 10 off 40 coupon. Almost everyone either had it on their app or in their mail that you got it from your mail. Um, so the little trick that they do with the coupon, since it's 10 off 40, um, even if you get four of them, you still go under the $40. So you end up totaling the 
$39.95, I believe. But what we did do instead of get a whole another candle, which brought us up to almost $50, we just got we just got one of these hand sanitizer pocket little mini ones. They are $1.95, so that's really, really cute. So that $1.95 brought us up to our $40 plus tax, and then it ended up being like $44 with tax and then with that 10 off 40 we ended up paying 33 dollars and 18 cents for all of this so let me show you guys which scents i grabbed so like i said i only grabbed four candles mainly christmas themed scents for the upcoming holidays and then also this one little hand sanitizer to put us over 40 dollars for that coupon i got the sugared snicker doodle i really love this scent and then also the little let me show you guys the design is so beautiful for christmas i'll probably be putting one up somewhere here in the living room and then this top is just so beautiful sometimes i just don't want to throw them away even after they're burnt so something that i do do um the last day when i know that it's you know the little wicks aren't going to burn anymore i let it burn all the way all the way through that way it's all liquid and then i put them into a a, a tupperware obviously one that i'm not going to be putting food in but i have little tupperware um set aside and specifically for my candles so if i have multiples of one scent i'll just continue filling those up and i'll break them into little wax melts and i'll burn them in my wax melt burner in my room so that way i can use up all the product because then usually there's about this much this much left of product once the wick runs out so that is a lot of product actually if you think about it it's around six little cubes of wax melt so that's what i do to save you know more money and um, make sure to use the full product for my full buck because i paid the full price so i'm gonna use the full product the next scent that i grabbed was strawberry snowflakes i really like this one it just smelled like strawberries honestly but i really love this packaging like look at that it's so beautiful it's like a pink a purple white snow beautiful and then this top look at that little snowflake design it is beautiful 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 and then the last two that I grabbed, this one was the Mary Cookie. It also smells similar to the, the Sugared Snickerdoodle, similar to that one. It's really pretty as well. The design has a little gingerbread with snowflakes, and then the top is also so pretty. It has little stars. Yep, and then my last candle is this one. I love the little top on it it's a little christmas tree and then it just has a lot of little different christmas trees i think they're supposed to be gingerbread cookies or something like that and it's the bright christmas morning i love it love that and then my pocket i did get into the night because i got a few of these mists so this might be a gift if not i might end up keeping it because i did get a mist and like a lotion for it and i really love this scent so that's why i grabbed the pocket hand sanitizer so i'm gonna show you guys my receipt right here like i said their sale all the three week of candles were 9.95 and then you total we had a total discount of 75 dollars and 20 cents we also used the store coupon the 10 off 40 um giving us a few discounts on the candles so we actually ended up paying 757 with our coupon for each candle so each candle was 757 with our coupon then like i said always remember to pick up these freebies they are for a christmas packaging so here the mist fits a full-size mist fits here or two of the small lotions fit in these baggies i already wrapped a few gifts in these and then this is how you close it up on top and then you can add this also to your bow right here and it says a little joy just for you and then on the back it says to and from and bath and body works um i put these on a few gifts that weren't even bath and body works just to put the to and from and i just think they're super cute i grabbed a big stack because last time i grabbed a big stack like this and i used all of them up so I grabbed a few extras to have in storage and a few extra for a few last few gifts that I still have to run out and get. So they do have these bows and then they also have these, this that says give love this Christmas and we love that. And then this one that says a little joy just for you. So they do have different options and these are the red ones and then at a different store that I went they also had the blue ones. 
I also forgot to mention that the bag is a reusable Bath & Body Works bag. This is the second time that they've done this. The first year they did this, but I believe the first year the, the tote bag was bigger than this um this one only fits two of the cartons the other one fit three in them so it was bigger i do have that one in storage but i think i am gonna be using this one for my regular bath and body works shopping because this one is smaller it's more reasonable if you just go in to get a few items and yeah the other one is bigger but i'm loving this loving it hopefully they come out with you know different colors christmas themed colors depending when candle day is you know maybe a different color i get that this is the bath and body Works, um logo but it would be nice if it was like christmas theme or something like that since it is in december so yeah Alrighty guys, thanks for watching. This is a little short one just because I wanted to put this out for you guys to see what I got for Candle Day. Um, Candle Day was yesterday, today, and it's also tomorrow. Today and tomorrow is in store and online. I would just say run out to the store if you have a chance instead of buying online because I think you do have to put in your email and wait in line for online. Um, their website has been like that since yesterday, so I decided to just run out instead of just waiting online and then also i didn't want to take the risk of getting it online and then when it's shipped for them to be broken or anything like that because you know during shipping anything can really happen and i don't want it to be broken by the time it gets here and then i still have to go in store so just go in store at this point <laughs>